Chicago is a great city and we've got to restore it. But interestingly enough, a week ago, you probably heard me refer to it as a hellhole. Well, that comment Darren Bailey made about Chicago several weeks ago remains key now that he's the Republican nominee for governor. Bailey faces incumbent J.B. Pritzker in November. How can you win the biggest city in the state after referring to it as a hellhole? Our Tim McNicholas and Dana Kosloff asked both candidates about the controversial comment. You've called Chicago a, a dysfunctional hellhole. Um, you're going to need votes from Chicago and the surrounding areas, the suburbs. Do you have any regrets about the way you phrase that? From what I'm gathering, I believe the people of Chicago have respect for someone who's standing up and telling the truth. Isn't it ironic that within hours after I said that, that a homeless man was burned alive? And isn't it even more ironic that the person that committed that terrible crime was roaming free from no cash bail from a previous crime that was committed? There's the breakdown and dysfunction of, of Chicago. It's interesting that I've heard, uh, you know, recently this, that all these has decided to move out. They don't feel safe. Uh, businesses, the, the magnificent mile has become not so magnificent because the businesses are leaving, they're fleeing, and no one's flocking to come back. Let's turn that around. Let's call it what it is. The people of Chicago deserve better. How do you see your campaign, if at all, using Darren Bailey's comment, which you brought up, uh, Chicago is a hellhole against him? Can we expect to see that prominently in ads? That isn't the only thing that, that Darren Bailey has done against Chicago. He also wanted Chicago to become a separate state, to literally to hive it off and make it a separate state from the rest of Illinois. Separating people from one another, dividing people, that's not what we're about in Illinois. This is the land of Lincoln. This is the home state of Barack Obama. You know, we're, we're proud in Illinois to be one state, and one Illinois. That's what our campaign is about. That's what this state is really all about. Uh, and our opponent on the Republican side only wants to divide people. Tonight at 6, Tim and Dana ask both candidates about luring companies to Illinois and making sure those that are here don't leave.